where the drinks are never on the house. Bring all your jewelry and lay it about your feet in intricate patterns. And when you fall down, and when you fall down, it won't catch you. I'm afraid we're going to die. I'm afraid we're going to die. And that's okay, because we're so pretty. Pretty enough to know. Pretty enough to know to say goodbye. To die. Saw you at the party on Sunset in La Placenta. Where you had to punch a doorman in the nose. Say something dirty about his mother just to get in. I know not you. I saw you sneak in through the side door. And I never saw you take on the punch bowl. So what? So what? So what if I did? It was full of erase and wrappings. And when I choked, I didn't choke alone. I'm afraid we're going to die. I'm afraid we're going to die. And that's okay. Because we're so pretty. <laughs> we found ourselves in like one of the worst situations, just like a show with no audience and and like a unenthusiastic staff. And uh, we just it ended up being the best show ever. We we just played for the other bands. This is in New London, Connecticut, and they were just it was just great. Really cold. Yes, it was really cold. cold. Bitter. Unaccommodating local presence. <laughs> but yeah, we, we did meet some of our best friends that we've met on the road at that show. Yeah, it's great. Yeah, it's funny, just like the uh, one thing I've learned, like just in this last year of touring, is just the getting out on the road and like doing seemingly, I don't know, just night after night, it seems like you're just banging your head into the ground, but. Like, it's crazy how many doors open up through just getting out there and uh, playing shows over and over. Like, we've made so many interesting connections through the most unassuming means. Yeah. So that's kind of like where I gather. It's just like the good old-fashioned work ethic actually does pay off. <laughs> well, that, that night that you had that was, that could have been a nightmare where, you know, no crowd, yeah, what, what do you think made the difference there? I mean, you, you go back to the heart of why you got into this in the first place, because of the love of playing, or...? 
Yeah. Yeah, I think, you know, those kinds of nights, especially since we met some of our friends in this band called the Bovilles, it's just like, you know, it's good to meet bands or people that just kind of get it, you know, some nights you have those nights where no one shows up or whatever, and you just, you just play your hardest to them because you want to just like show them that it's, you know, both you guys kind of get it. And so we ended up being able to like a really good time and, you know, if we're going to play a show, we might as well just play the show as hard as we can, you know. I know. That, that particular tour, we were out um, kind of co-headlining with some friends of ours in a band called Toy Bombs. And those guys um, are just really good friends of ours. And we had driven just so far and we were tired and cold. And so all we had <laughs> was that show to make us happy. And so we're just <laughs> like, we're playing it. I don't care if there's anybody here. And then we all kind of rallied around the show, and then it just kind of escalated, and then we met the other bands. And actually, through that show, um, is like the reason why we're out here. We ended up meeting some people that kind of connected us into the South. And so that stupid little show ended up like opening the door to like another six months of Southern tours. And wow. The cold brought us to the hot. Yeah. I think Tony pranced out on the road and declared himself the mayor of New London <laughs> on a megaphone <laughs> to his empty street. Let's put it out on the right foot. You know? Yeah. And, and you guys are, are traveling in a van. How do you keep from killing each other from being out the road for the tight quarters for a year? <laughs> we don't. Yeah, we don't. <laughs> um, you have a video out called Pretty. And that is an amazing video. How did that come about? We actually, uh, Tony is kind of like our film uh, like specialist among the bunch and moving to LA there's like a ton of film types that we just sort of linked up with and I uh, met a great guy by the name of Colin Mapp who uh, is doing film and doing really well at it. And that was sort of his idea and we just kind of went with it and shot it around our neighborhood in Los Angeles and started, got accepted into the South by Southwest wow. film and festival. A few and, other festivals too. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's amazing. I mean, it's just like you walk from the heart. You can see that there's, you know, uh, like like your own little genre that you're putting together. I mean, you, you're, you're not like this band, and you're not like that band. And I, I've watched that video and listened to your music because of that over and over and over. And how did you come up with the sound? Uh, I mean, well, I guess what you just said, like, that's kind of been a mission statement of ours since we started, is just to kind of be ourselves. and not try to be like anybody else or any other style of music. We're all pretty diverse individuals. And so as a band, we come together and kind of bring all of our own influences or whatever. And it kind of just makes our own little unique sound. I mean, coming up in Provo, Utah, it's a lot of indie folk, kind of mellow, good songs, like great bands, but our mission was to kind of be different and get everyone dancing and just be as crazy and fun as possible I guess well like I feel like with us it's easy to do too because we're so totally like we all come from way different spots and to, to like have something that we all agree on ends up being something that's really different you know like if it was any one of us it would be it might be something you know more homogenous but yeah. together we sort of like go to like something else you know I about that. so Tony Yo Gabba Gabba. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Do you really watch Yo Gabba Gabba? Uh, I... Sometimes. <laughs> I'm not sure <laughs> what's been told. Um, <laughs> this guy's done his homework. Um, I, I, I've, I've got friends involved with the show and oh, okay. stuff like that. But, uh, it's really cool from what I've seen of it. <laughs> I'm, uh, my granddaughter watches it, and yeah. it's like, you know, and they're playing over and over and over, and I just got this smile on my face when I was looking at your profile, and it said, Yo, Gabba Gabba, I'm like, uh, yeah. <laughs> So be careful about what you put on your uh, profile. Yeah, yeah totally. It, it may pop back up. No, yeah, well, hey, I'm not ashamed. Uh, no, yeah, my nieces watch that show, too, and uh, I got a kick out of it. Because um, I'd seen some clips before it was released, because I knew people involved with it. I, it blew me away just how weird and odd it was, and uh, so then I was just really happy when I saw that my nieces were watching it uh, when it finally came out. It's been interesting to meet some of like the 
I guess, what is Will, producer? Some of the, like, the guys involved we met down in LA. It's oh, kind of yeah. like interesting. Awesome. Yeah. yeah. So, cool show. Spanish. Watch it. Do you really speak French? I do. Really? How did that come about? I lived in France and Belgium for two years. Wow. Serving a, an LDS mission out there. Wow. Yeah. That it's, is it's awesome. all true. <laughs> <laughs> it's all true. Okay, Aaron. Uh, who's the lucky one that uh, won the roast card? <laughs> Everybody's a winner with the roast card. That's the great thing about it. Oh. I'm so confused. <laughs> I don't know. What okay, the <laughs> roast card. Instead of a postcard, he has a thing called the roast card over the internet. Oh. Where he sends out roast cards. Okay. Fans. <laughs> a few, <laughs> few roast cards a day makes the smiles yeah, that's cool. not go away. Okay, um, and then Thomas, what are you gonna do for your birthday? Drive. I wanna. My birthday wish is to drive. Uh, get us out of Texas before sunrise. I guess. <laughs> <laughs> that's a lot of driving. <laughs> but no, I mean, yeah, I mean, we'll probably just drive. Start driving. Probably just be heading home. I just. Don't really have any plans. Big 23. Wow. Are there any amusement parks on the way? Yeah, there's a couple, but I just keep on driving. <laughs> <laughs> any Chuck E. Cheese's in the vicinity? Actually, uh, yeah. Yeah. Be great. yeah. If you guys could say something to your fans, because your fans are going to see this, and you want to give them a message, what would that message be? Thank you. First and foremost, we've fortunately just have some of the most supportive, loving people that are behind us and that are so supportive of our of our music and what we're trying to do. We just have a great family. They're like our family. Most of our fans are, I would consider, pretty much family. We love them very much and very thankful for them. That's my message. <laughs> <laughs> You're special just the way you are. There's no one else in the world quite like you. Wow, that's sweet. <laughs> that, that's like a video roast And uh, can you frame like a rain, like a yeah, rainbow? Yeah, I'll put a little rainbow, rainbow around the <laughs> We'll do a Yo Gabba Gabba. Yeah, yeah. Like a shooting <laughs> star going across the tape at the video game. I, I wish I could touch you right now. I wish I could touch you. That's good. See, now we just came up with a new song. Yeah, it's going to be a hit. <laughs> All right. Uh, I hope you. I hope you look forward to the stuff we have coming out because we're very excited about it. Awesome. Well, you know, I thank you guys for this this interview. I mean, it was awesome. Again, I know you guys are exhausted. I'm gonna get some footage of you tonight and tie all this in together. Um, I wish you guys luck. You know, there's a. I look at a lot of bands, and you know, it takes a lot of time, and, and I found you because of that that uh, video, pretty. So congratulations on awesome. that. Thank, thank you very much. Have, have a safe trip back home. And again, thank you. Thank All you. Right. Thank you so much. All right, we'll get some rest. Thank you. All right. <laughs> Thank you very much. We are eyes and lips eyes. Please come say hello. We love you, Dallas. <laughs>